where to an actor Pran is no more. The villain of the millennium, the bad man with a golden heart, Pran died at the age of 93 at Mumbai's Lilawati Hospital. Pran had been suffering from a chronic illness. He'd been hospitalized after he felt uneasiness in breathing. The actor's last rites will be performed today at noon at Mumbai's Shivaji Park. The 93 year old actor was given the Dada Sahib Falke Award, the highest honor in Indian cinema on the 10th of May at his residence in Mumbai. Because of his poor health, Pran could not make it to the 60th National Film Awards ceremony held in Delhi in May. Timeless and best known as the villain in Zanji, Pran acted in over 400 movies in a career spanning over six decades and played a huge variety of roles. As news of the actor's death broke, tributes have been pouring in from Bollywood. Pran Kishan Sikanda, who was uh, better known uh, just as uh, Pran to all Bollywood film lovers, uh, he's passed away. And Bollywood, obviously, the tributes have started pouring in from various people. You have to remember the last rites of Pran will be conducted today at Shivaji Park at noon. And uh, there's already lots of Bollywood celebrities coming in uh, who you will just see on your screen. Pran was called the villain of the millennium and is on the list of CNN's top 25 Asian actors of all time. He appeared in 350 films from the 1940s to the 1990s and has played both positive and negative roles with equal passion. He's known for films like Zanjeer, Dawn and Amar Akbar Anthony. Like every actor, there were two sides to Pran. Let's relive the life and times of the wet night. The greatest bad man of Hindi films. The villain of the millennium. The bad man with a golden heart. And Pran is who we are talking about. He once famously said that a villain shouldn't behave like one. They should behave like heroes and nurture a villainous streak within. But this man was known for his warm, humble, obedient ways. Stories of his acts of philanthropy and social service are legions. Even though the name Pran was given to a very few children between 1960s and the 1970s, the peak of Pran's career, his greatest achievement according to him was the fact that his granddaughter named her son Amar Pran after him. Pran Sikhan's tryst with Hindi cinema began way back in 1942 in a film called Khandan, where he played the main lead. Now, nahin, budde, varna, Mr. Song, take Mr. Raj to his room. And take good care of him. Achhi tarah khatar dwaja ki jaye. Hero, villain, character, actor, comedian. Pran donned many a hat, but each character he played was with great confidence, defiance, and aplomb. Aap hi ke matlab ki baat hai, Mr. Bragenda. Main puchne aaya hu aapko kitna paisa chahiye. Post independence. His first successful movie was Badi Behen in 1949. Pran was regularly offered the role of the main villain or negative character in the films with Dilip Kumar, Devanath, and Raj Kapoor in the 1950s and 60s. It's not Pran's performance as a negative character in films like Azad, Madhumati, Tetas, Dil Diya Dard Liya, Ram or Sham and Admi were greatly appreciated. Heroes came and went, but Pran was a constant. His association with Devanand, which began in the 1948, continued even during the 70s and the 80s. With Johnny Mera Naam, Ye Gulistan Hamara, 
जोशीला वॉरेंट एंड देश पर देश इज आइकॉनिक कैरेक्टर्स ऑफ राका फ्रॉम जिस देश में गंगा बहती है इन नाइनटीन सिक्सटी वन इज यूज ऑफ द ब्लू कॉन्टैक्ट लेंसेज इन ट्रिकली हेयर स्टाइल फॉर द रोल ऑफ गजेंद्र इन राम और शाम मेरे मना करने के बावजूद इसकी ये जरूरत आज मैं इसकी चमड़ी उधेर दूंगा His introduction of comedy in villainy, or his iconic role of the Pathan in Zanjeer. Aaj tak Sher Khan se kisi ne itni badi baat nahi kahi. Ye tum nahi, tumhari vardi, tumhari kutsi bol rahi hai. Jis din ye vardi, ye kutsi nahi hogi, us din tum. Shut up, you bloody liar! Nahi sahab. Gala kharaab ho jayega. Pran ensured that each character he played was etched out uniquely. Be it his fascination for various get-ups or his adept mannerism. Pran Sahib was the stuff legends were made of. Entertainment Bureau headlines today. Very very sad day for Bollywood indeed. Let's go across to Surya Singh standing by. with uh, more on what the exact arrangements are and what time will the final rise finally take place uh, surya over to you absolutely uh, well uh, the final rise will be taking place near uh, shivaji park electric uh, crematorium where the body will be taken on 10:30 the body would depart from here that is leela vati which is right behind me where the body has been kept as of now and uh, 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 you know uh, since uh, last night you know this uh, sunil pran san uh, told us that you know as the body was not in the condition that it could be uh, taken home for a longer period of time that's why they decided to keep the body in leela vati hospital only and they would depart directly from the hospital to the auditorium around 10:30 and 12 o'clock is the time when the funeral in the last rites would be conducted and uh, as you know you know the whole uh, bollywood is in a state of shock it's an end of an era in bollywood right so yeah thanks a lot uh, for this uh, update obviously we'll uh, keep uh, coming back to you as the day progresses uh, for the moment 